Okay, so we have been talking for about 30 minutes, and she had me facing some crazy direction. Like, I really couldn't see anything. She was hiding from me that she was cleaning her bike again. Because every time she rides her bike, she does this. She cleans the chain with Q-tips because she's OCD. I told her, you don't need to clean the bike chain, like, ever almost. When I was a kid, I drove my bike for probably you know, six years. I never cleaned the chain once. And you clean it, like, every, every what, every two days, every three days? Every three days. Every two days. Yeah. Every two days. And she knows, she knows it drives me crazy because... Because she doesn't need to do it. But this is what she does. She has OCD. Right? Right, Bob? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's good. I guess it's better than, like, hoarding and some of the other crazy OCDs. I need to put the oil on this. Yeah, because then you just want to clean it again. Show me, that. Show me how dirty that Q-tip is. Huh? I said, show me how dirty your Q-tip is. It's here. I got three here now. Look how dirty oh, it is. Oh, very dirty. And a very clean bicycle chain. <laughs> that's so crazy. Oh, my God, that's crazy. <laughs> So I'm here in the Cardinal. This, uh, they have a really good cake. Uh, it's not so sweet, that's why I like it. Uh, this is the things that... So I just got home and I'm going to surprise my neighbor because I, today is her birthday. And me and her husband were trying to get this as a surprise. So. I will show you this is the cake that I bought for her. Actually, this cake is really good and, and it's not so sweet, so I kind of like the taste of this. And so far, this is our favorite, me and her. So, we'll see. Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you! Today I'm going to jumping ropes. Happy birthday! You're going to join with me. Huh? Huh? Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to grocery together with my neighbor. Uh, she's getting ready right now. So actually, we can't go out without this quarantine pass. This is the quarantine pass. It looks like. So I have to show this to police or whatever. Look, there's a checkpoint there. 
Okay, so we're walking right now. That's my neighbor. And we're going to buy some grocery because it's coming Saturday. They have this uh, hardly lockdown. And I need to have a stock in my, in my apartment. So. so this is the street. Um, this is called Scaryu. Uh, this is overheating to Ayala. weeks ago, um, the president in the Philippines, they deploy a military here in Cebu City because Cebu City, there's a lot of cases here and and they assign the military in, in the barangay or in this area where there's a lot of case for a COVID and in Ayala Street <laughs> Thank you. Hey, that you must say. Muru ko nung dosi ko nung. Finally, we arrived in Ayala. Ayala. <laughs> <laughs> wow, it's very quiet. Everybody is close there except the grocery and the pharmacy. There's some stars are open here, like, like Goldilocks over bank.
we're, la we're just lucky because um, there's not so many people um, waiting for a line. Supposedly the area is well 